What's up guys, welcome to today's video. We get started. As always, thank you guys for watching. And um, if you guys got one second, just hit the like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications so you guys get notified. Seriously helps a lot. I got a little change. I'm gonna walk you guys through a workout. I think we're gonna do shoulders and arms, so we're gonna do a how to get big shoulders and how to, get, how to grow your arms. We have road mics today. Your boy finally made the investment and got these wireless road mics. I told you guys I wanna get back on the content grind on Amazon, so if you guys wanna do TikToks for the mic'd up or like workouts where I can kinda like explain my workout and walk you guys through it. Yeah, I feel like it's a good investment if you guys wanna do like content creation. We got our pre-workout meal of this Babigo rice, 310 calories, some steak, guac, a little bit of sriracha mayo, like half a serving, some bourbon chicken sauce, half a serving, fucking good. All right, so you boys about to head to the gym. Me and Tom, I'm gonna do uh, shoulders and arms. I'm gonna walk you guys to the workout. Um, before we go, I wanna show you guys a little update on the sneaker videos supposed to be making. So unfortunately, I was doing a challenge, $1,000 to $10,000 challenge. Long story short, your boy lost the first video. The SD card uh, got corrupted and I lost all the footage. Boy got from 1,000 to like 4,500, which took me about two and a half weeks. I was excited to post that shit, but unfortunately I lost it. And I don't wanna start over, because obviously, it's hard to find good deals all the time, and I'd kind of wasted two and a half to three weeks doing that. So I'm just gonna do mystery box openings instead. They're easier to make videos on, they're enjoyable to watch, shorter form content, like eight, nine minutes, unboxing the shoe, showing you them, showing you where I got the box, resale value, stuff like that. It's easier to understand like buying and selling and like making profit, because I do wanna teach you guys how to make money from side hustles, so you don't have to work a nine to five job, or you can have a side hustle, like pay for the gym stuff, or like going on vacations, or just, you know, having some extra money to put into savings. Bunch of pairs of fours, some eights, Supreme Vans, more fours, a bunch of 11s and fives. I have some really good ones. Um, then we have all the hype stuff is over here. So we got some black cats. We have two pairs of black cats, a bunch of fours, dunks, um, some brand new dead sock shoes and stuff as well. So if you guys are interested in any of these, I'm selling them on Mercari, eBay, OfferUp, Facebook Marketplace. And like those are like the general websites that you guys can sell on. And then I also have an Instagram, Italian Unlaced. So if you guys are interested, I'll probably post a bunch of these, like shoes, size, multiple pictures, descriptions, all of that. A bunch of you guys have already bought from me. Yeah, your boy's been going, been all over the place, but I'm settled back down in Houston now. I have more time to deal with the sneaker end of the business. And um, I really wanna show you guys how to make some money on the side, side hustles. But yeah, let's head over to the gym and uh, get it started. All right guys, so I have good news and I have bad news. Good news, I might have a temporary excuse to not have to hit legs. Bad news, I might have seriously fucked up my knee. A couple days ago I was hitting legs. I didn't, I didn't wanna like say it earlier in the video because I didn't wanna sound like a pussy. Thank you, Dr. Stamps. If you guys are at Alpha Land, 100% recommend getting some work done. She helped me a lot with my shoulder. And we're gonna see if I like tore something. Yeah, um, all right, so just go back a little bit. Okay. It, it doesn't hurt until I stand on it. Like I've been okay. limping for like four days. Just apply a little pressure here. No. Okay, what about whenever I'm here and push? Are you no. Okay with that? Good. All right, lay on back, sit down a little bit, lay on back, we're gonna push on that. Any pain there? No. Good. Okay. What about when I come here? Any pain with that? When I bend my knee like this, yeah. it's in here, deep like. In there? Deep in there. And it keeps like popping when I wake up in the morning. <laughs> You want to put a needle in my leg? Sure. Doctor. <laughs> Doctor Kush. <laughs> Doctor D's hands, bro. Yeah, you get fried. Look it up, bro. <laughs> Dude takes a, takes a bong rip and just pokes me with a needle. Maybe that's what you want. Hamstring strain I can deal with. Like a ACL, MCL, meniscus, like something that actually needs like surgery, like would suck. We don't have time for that. I don't, right? I don't have time for surgery. Not if I want to be Mr. Olympia. Shout out Lil Bummy. Congratulations on the engagement. Yo, you heard Sebum got engaged? Yeah. I'm his best man. Actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's gonna put a he's gonna he's gonna put a dog collar on me with the ring, and I'm gonna walk down the aisle like barking. Me and Pudson. Right, Chris? What the fuck? <laughs> what? Yeah. You ever seen the videos like where the dogs where the dogs have like the 
the ring around the neck. That's gonna be me and the dog, like me and his dog so Hudson. Yeah. Be like a golden retriever. Ah, I think of myself more like a Pipple Rottweiler mix, uh, but I could take a golden. I don't know. I, I think a little golden retriever. Golden, golden retrievers are known for b biting children, so I guess me and them <laughs> are similar in that aspect. <laughs> Extra protein. What this one's not about? We got the injured leg flex. Not able, not able to flex all the way yet, but uh, I think we'll be better. Hopefully it's not torn. She said it doesn't look like it's a tear. If anything, it'd be a partial tear of like my meniscus Potentially or like pumiscus. I don't know what the fuck she said. I don't speak um, Spanish BPC injections all that stuff. Uh, we're gonna work on it. But yeah, we're gonna hit shoulders today I'll walk you guys through my workout Keep your arms and elbows as straight as you can keep your arms as wide as you have to in order to get a good Stretch in there baseball stretch. So you take your arm like this put the bar behind grab it grab it at the bottom here and bend in. You don't have to pull. You don't have to pull too far. You just want to be able to feel a good stretch, but it shouldn't hurt. Is like these arm circles. So we go around and then over. Around and over and There's a great little warm-up set that I do. So I do 10 switch hands and I do 10 rotations in. Keep your elbow tucked to your side, open up, close, tuck to your side, open up. First thing you want to do on a shoulder day after you warm up, I like to start with a heavy overhead press, and then the rest of the movements I like to do, focus around building weak points of your shoulder, because it's built up into three heads. Your front delt, your lateral delt, or medial delt, and then your rear delt, which is going to give you the overall bolder shape. I do this movement by itself, and then I like to do the rest of my shoulder movements superset it with arm movement. A triple set of shoulder, bicep, tricep, bicep, tricep, shoulder. Any way that I like to set up the set, prioritize hitting all heads of your bicep, which there's two heads. Technically three if you have your, your short head and your long head, and then your tricep also has three heads. So you want to have different movements for different parts of the muscle. We're going to do a set of 8 to 12 reps, slow and controlled, up the weight, again, 8 to 12 reps. Last set is our third set. We're going to do 8 to 12 reps, drop set, 8 to 12 reps, drop again, hopefully, to failure. I know I'm joking around a lot about my knee, but I'm, I'm genuinely worried. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if I can hide the worriness with, with comedy much longer. I'm fucking scared. This is a banger. What are you talking about? Is this Fetty Wap? Yeah. Oh, that one-eyed bandit, bro. See the coochie with one eye still chase it. Hey! Since your boy is injured, I don't want to do a lot of standing movements that hold weight, so a standing bicep curl. So I'm going to do seated. This can feel more than free to do a standing bicep movement. Bicep curl, so keep your arm in the pronated position. Curl up, slow down, curl up. A three second negative with a one second like positive. So up, one, two, three. Then we're going to move over to a tricep movement and then a lateral like uh, shoulder movement all in one triple set. So it's going to be Bicep, tricep, shoulder. So instead of grabbing it and taking the stress off of your forearm to grab it, rest your hands like this, kind of rest it in your palms. Up, one, two, three. Down, two, three, down. Pretty much you can't do anymore. Lean over it, throw it down. Our arm 
arms slightly in front of us. Feet here, allow your body to hang. Your arm is in a already stretched position. Here and up, all the way above your head. Slow down, arm out in front of you, stretch up. to touch the muscle the other person is working to remind them to, to keep constant tension on that that muscle. I cousin can't trust me because if cousin I do it to cousin I just finger his butthole. But um, especially on leg day. But if you guys have a friend you trust. exercises three rounds like three sets each this last set to drop says I'm gonna move 35s as many as I can go to failure drop set to 15 again to failure or one shy continue on with the sets Now we're going to train our bicep in the front position. Just like triple set, drop set, whatever the fuck. Okay, so for this movement, relax your shoulders back. You're here. Keep your elbows at a slight bend. Use your the side of your palms on the side. Chest forward, shoulders back. All right, next thing we're gonna do, triceps, is katana extensions. your shoulder we're gonna do slow control three sets of 15 reps last set to drop set all right so we're starting off 
heavy hammer curls, pretty much go to failure, drop set, rotational curl. So my camera's about to die, so I gotta be quick. All right, guys, last tricep movement. It's skull crusher. When you can't do any more, go to press, close press. All right, the very last movement of the workout, shoulder superset, quadruple 5,000, I don't know, a threesome? No, nah, it's a, a I don't know, a fucking shoulder orgy. This is my this is my shoulder orgy set. 10 lateral, do 10 rear delt, 10 front delt, take like a 30 second break, drop the weight, grab a lower weight that's like 15 pounds from 30, and then go again, same thing, 10, 10, 10. This last movement of the workout. All right, so before I walk you guys through, do a knock and drop for October 15th. I'm not supposed to tell you guys when it drops yet. They have not released the date. But since you guys uh, are subscribed to the channel, hopefully Charlie doesn't fire me. But yeah, it is what it is. Um, I'm gonna walk you guys through the drop. I'm gonna be doing a giveaway. So I think I'm gonna pick five people to win a $100 gift card, so $500 giveaway for YouTube. And I'm gonna try to do another giveaway on Instagram, maybe three or five more people uh, for a giveaway. So stay tuned. Comment your guys' favorite item down below to be entered to win. And, uh, my bad. I ate too much ass last night. I'm farting up, I'm farting out of my throat now. Let's get on with the uh, little preview of what's dropping. August, no, this October, bro. I'm so behind. October 15th, 11 a.m. Eastern. That's a Saturday. We have 12 pairs of shorts. We have six new basics dropping. The rug pack dropping. So these are probably some of my favorites that we've dropped yet. We have a bunch of different prints. For the rug pack, I'm six foot, one and a half on a good day. Um, on a bad day, like five, eight and three quarters. For an extra large short and a two X to a one X top. So I'm pretty sure this is a uh, two X t-shirt. So two X top, one X uh, bottoms. These are the other six shorts that are dropping, the basic pairs. So if you guys want, screenshot, remember code Italian, um, Saturday all the basics we also have like 12 shorts and a couple hoodies dropping so these are all the t-shirts that are dropping we have the Anaka wings tee my like favorite like style t-shirts they're pretty simple the small front print big back print uh, basic tees where they just say Anaka power across the front I think there's a few different colorways of that yeah, there's three. I'm pretty sure there's more than three. Then we have this Anaka front print tee. Another small logo in the front. Big logo in the back. A few different colors of those. There's more of the Anaka print tees right here. We have two colorways of this like vulture tee. I'm gonna just call it the vulture tee or the predator tee, you know. 50 years old is not too old. If she's 50 and ready to get with it, get with it. We got some more of these tees. Your boy's a big fan of these basics. So we have the front and then the same thing in the back. We have the three bears tee and the tee I'm wearing right now. One new hoodie dropping. There is like a rug fabric texture because the shorts that are dropping are the rug pack, so the top of the hoodie has embroidered, like almost like a rug. But yeah, that's everything dropping. We're also having accessories drop, like new knee sleeves, belts, elbow sleeves, wrist wraps, stuff like that. But yeah, thank you guys for sticking to the end of the video. Gave you guys a little sneak peek of the stuff dropping. October 15th, a Saturday morning. 